Hey you guys, so today I'm gonna to be sharing some amazing dupes of my favorite high-end products. Now of course I do love my high-end products, but if I can get the same thing for a fraction of the cost, of course I'm gonna go with the alternative. So I hope you guys like the products that I picked out. Let's get right into all the products and all the dupes. Okay, so I feel like the way I'm gonna do this video is actually in the order that I applied my makeup. I feel like that's like the easiest way to do it. So I'm gonna share one of my favorite primers, and this is actually not even a primer. This is like a multi-purpose product, but this is from Tarte, and it's called the Brighter Days Highlighting Moisturizer, and it looks like this. Now, I love using this underneath my makeup. That is what I did on this side of my face. I also love using this on days when I don't wanna wear any makeup, but I still want my skin to have that beautiful, like glow from within look. I love using this but it retails for $32. So I found an amazing dupe for it, and this is the L'Oreal New Magic Lumi Light Infusing Primer. And this just leaves your skin with the most beautiful glow. And this is under $10. So if you guys have been following me for a while, you know that I love the Makeup Forever Ultra HD Foundation. And for anyone that is wondering, I'm in the shade Y405. It is lightweight, but still like medium to full coverage. I love the satin matte finish. It's long lasting and it's beautiful if you are looking to be photographed. It has no flashback and it just makes your skin look like photoshopped in real life. So I love this foundation, but this retails for $43. Now I did find an amazing dupe for it. This is the LA Girl Pro Coverage HD Foundation, and this is a long wear illuminating foundation. If you guys are close to my true skin tone, like my NC42 skin tone, I'm in the shade Warm Beige, but you can see it on this side. And it still looks so natural, like you can't even tell the difference, right, between the two foundations. They literally are the same exact formula, finish, they wear the same way, and they also photograph beautifully. And the Girl Foundation is exactly $10. So that is such a steal compared to the Makeup Forever Ultra HD. I still have to say that this is still one of my all-time favorites, but if you are looking for a cheaper alternative, this is definitely the way to go. Okay, next up, I'm going to be sharing one of my favorite dupes from this bunch because the price difference is crazy, but I have exactly the same product for like a fraction of the cost. But anyway, this is the Charlotte Tilbury Filmstar Bronze and Glow Face Sculpt and Highlight, and this is what this looks like. It is a beautiful highlight and contour duo. The highlight on this side is very, very natural. And then the contour right here is actually my favorite part because it is just so natural on the skin. And it is like the perfect amount of cool. It's not like too cool where it starts to look gray, but it's not warm. It's just perfect to contour your face. I am using this today on the side of my face and you can see it's just beautiful. Now, as much as I love this duo, it retails for $68, which I just think that is so crazy. But of course, Charlotte Tilbury is a very, very high-end brand. But I do have a drugstore dupe that is so comparable, it's insane. And this is the L'Oreal Infallible Pro Contour. And you guys, I have to actually hold this side by side so you can see how insanely identical these two are. Even the highlights in this kit, or not kit, these duos, are so similar because they're very, very subtle and natural on the skin. And the contours, I mean, hopefully my camera's picking it up, but they look identical. It's so crazy. They even feel very, very similar when you apply it on the skin. And it retails for about $10, but again, I've always seen this stuff on sale. So one of my all-time and most used beauty tools is definitely this very dirty beauty blender. And it's dirty because I did use this today to apply my makeup. And this retails for $20. Now, I have tried so many other beauty sponges in the market, and I never seem to find like one that is quite like the Beauty Blender because this is so like squishy and soft and it just like expands so much when you wet it and it does such a beautiful job at applying your makeup. And all the other beauty sponges that I try are either too hard, 
to firm, this sounds so dirty, but you guys get the point, right? Like it's really hard to find an actual dupe for this. Until I tried the Real Techniques Diamond Sponge. Now please ignore how freaking dirty this is. Again, I did just use this on this side of my face to apply my makeup. But this is so comparable in terms of like the feel and like the squishy factor and how it bouncy it is and how well it applies and blends your makeup. It is so comparable to the Beauty Blender and it's exactly half the price. The Real Techniques Salmon Sponge is definitely the closest dupe that I've found to the Beauty Blender. Okay, now on to one of my other favorite dupes from the bunch. This is the Becca Opal Highlight and this is like a cult favorite. I think after Champagne Pop, this is one of their other best sellers. This is such a beautiful, like true champagne highlight that is so pigmented but still natural on the skin and I just love Becca's highlights. Even though they are powder highlights, they feel like butter on the skin. They're just so creamy and pigmented and I have this over here. But these retail for $38 which is so crazy expensive. Now an amazing dupe that I found for the Opal highlight is the LA Girl Strobe Light Strobing Powder in the shade 50 Watt. I do want to hold this up side by side to the Opal shade because I do want you guys to see that when you hold them up side by side they actually don't look very similar. Opal, as you guys can see right here, looks very neutral and this um, LA Girl highlight looks like it has like a pink undertone. But when you actually apply it on the skin, they look exactly the same. Do you guys see that? The best part, of course, is the LA Girl highlight retails anywhere between $6 to $10 versus the $38 price point. So if you are looking to save money and get an amazing dupe of Opal, this LA Girl highlight is definitely the way to go. I have an amazing dupe for the Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. Now this is one of my all time favorite mascaras. I haven't now used this in a really long time but I did have a backup that I whipped out for this video and I was just like why have I not been using this because this literally gives you like false lashes with your real lashes. I'm gonna say if you are gonna splurge on a mascara the Better Than Sex is definitely the way to go because you will not be disappointed from this. But I actually found an amazing dupe that is available to you at the drugstore that does exactly the same thing and this retails for $9. And this is the new L'Oreal Voluminous Lash Paradise. But even the packaging is so similar. So here is a close up of the brushes. This one right here is the L'Oreal Mascara and this is the Too Faced and you can see for yourself they look so similar, they perform exactly the same, and I really just love this L'Oreal Paradise. It's just high quality, affordable, it's pretty to look at, and it just makes your lashes look amazing. I honestly recommend both of these, but if you are on a budget, the Lash Paradise is amazing and an exact dupe of the Better Than Sex. Okay, so I only have two more products left and my camera is running low on batteries, so we're gonna just talk real fast. But I found an amazing dupe for you guys for the Makeup Forever Aqua Excel Eye Pencils. Now you guys know that I love these and these are hands down my favorite eye pencils ever, especially for the waterline. You can see for yourself, I have had my makeup on now for, what, like six hours? I put it on this morning. And my waterline, the eyeliner is still there and it's just like very, very black, very pigmented. These are just amazing. They're about $21 and I personally feel like they're so worth the money because you will have these for such a long time. Now the dupe that I found for the Aqua XL is the Catrice Liquid Metal Gel Eye Pencils. Now I've used these pencils multiple times in my videos and I love these so, so much. Just like the Aqua XL, they're super, super creamy, long lasting, smudge proof, and they just glide on the eye. They're not as long lasting at the, as the Aqua XL. You can see like my eyeliner is fading a little bit on towards the end of my eye. Um, and you can see like the Aqua XL is like literally like tattooed on there. But for $4.99, like, I feel like that's a really, really good dupe. They're so high quality and very, very comparable to the Makeup Forever. Okay, there's the little Colpster. He's chilling back there. You know what's so funny is when he was so much younger, I could never have my makeup just sitting there like that because he would attack everything. But now he's older and wiser. I can't believe he's nine months, but he's just gonna chill back there. Right, bud? 
Aww. On to the last tube, and I definitely feel like I talked about this somewhere. I may have talked about this on Snapchat. If you guys are not following me there, you definitely need to. I'll put my name right here. Or I actually think I talked about it on my blog. That's where I think I talked about it. But this is an amazing dupe of the also infamous uh, Lolita lipstick from Kat Von D. And I am wearing this on my top lip. You can see it is such a beautiful shade. Highly recommend this. Where is it going? Where is it going? Oh my goodness. Doesn't that just melt your heart? He kills me. But anyway. The most amazing dupe for Lolita is the NYX Liquid Suede in the shade Soft Spoken and I have this on my bottom lip and you guys can see they're exactly the same. The formula is not the same, the formula is definitely very different but the color is exactly the same and this retails for $20 and this retails anywhere between $5 to $7. So if you are looking to purchase Lolita on a budget, the NYX Liquid Suede in the shade Soft Spoken is Definitely, definitely the way to go. All right guys, so that is it for this dupes video. Like I said, I also have some other dupes in my collection. I just wanted to keep this video relatively short. So if you guys wanna see me do another one of these videos, let me know in the comments below. Also, if you haven't yet, check out my last video where I swatched the MAC lipsticks, the 48 lipsticks, because I am holding a giveaway which will be ending this Friday. So if you haven't entered, definitely go ahead and enter that giveaway. As usual, don't forget to follow me on all my social media, subscribe to my channel, and I will talk to you guys in my next video. Bye!